Hi guys, this is a beach day for me. Isn't that beautiful? Can you hear the waves? I am uh, sunning my back right now because <laughs> I, uh, somebody had told me and uh, I did a little research on it, it happens to be true that um, you get most of the um, benefit from the sun and vitamin D through uh, the skin on your back. Who would know, right? But um, I'm also flipping around every few minutes to make sure I don't burn my face to a crisp in this sun, this winter sun. Um, we're still in January and um, just, um, you know, taking advantage of a beautiful day out today. Look at this. Beautiful blue skies. And I uh, got my umbrella in place and I'm right here with you look at you know I don't know if you guys have noticed my hair is coming back which is a great thing after chemo and also um, my face is filling out you know and I'm thinking gosh I gotta be careful um, I know I need some muscles on on uh, the torso but <laughs> I'm working on that too um, I'm not sure if you followed my journey or not if not you can kind of flip through the other videos but Basically, I was diagnosed with biliary cancer in March of 2020. And uh, actually, March of 2021. Oh, my. It's going to be a year. So, uh, man, how, you know, 2021 just flew by so fast, didn't it? I don't know about you, but it just, wow, it's gone. I'm laying out here on my beach towel, taking in the in the waves here in Naples, Florida. See our pier out there? And um, just keeping the camera close because I know the wind is just crazy. But I um, wanted to share that with you. And there is something I've been thinking about. And this might get a little weird, but I hope you stick with me here for a few minutes anyway. I have been thinking about thoughts and how thoughts can be transmitted um, how thoughts may not be fixed anywhere. You know, they're not physical things. So they're not like attached to your mind or somewhere in your body. And I'm thinking when they're transmitted out, they kind of blanket everything. So I came up with this blanket theory of, of thinking uh, through meditation. So here's how I'm thinking. If thoughts are actually something you can transmit out, you have what I think would be what you would call your world or your universe, right? Your, this is your thought universe. I mean, this is, as far as our finite minds can think, this is the area that my mind covers, right? When you think. So I'm thinking, if you think that way and you close your eyes, you can kind of like imagine a blanket going over your whole, the totality of your little or big, whatever size, your universe. And then in doing so, um, you can kind of send thoughts out to that, right? Doesn't that make sense to you? I was thinking, you know, I can like close my eyes, put that blanket out over my universe and this sounds weird but then start thinking thoughts of gratitude over my whole whatever right this is this is the the entirety of what I create with my mind so I can close my eyes and give thanks for and you can start doing you know I've started doing this I started giving thanks for individual things like you know I'm glad I had a nice flight last night glad that the passengers were great to work with my co-workers were great to work with just blessed you know thankful and you can do the other ways too like let's say that you have fear in your mind right now and they're fearful of something that hasn't happened yet but may happen let's say cancer maybe maybe you have cancer you just discovered that you have cancer so in my mind, you know, I would like, okay, close my eyes, blanketing my universe, and just 
taking out all those thoughts of fear and thinking that spirit's gonna help me through this I'm gonna be strong there's strength throughout my thought area my thought universe and going online and get the idea you know it's like I just put it out there and do not live in the land of fear everything's gonna work out for the best I put that thought out there instead like I can feel the strength I feel no fear in my universe Sending out thoughts of calm, the ocean waves in the background. Everything's gonna be all right. It's a financial area that you need to be worried about or that you worry about, don't need to be worried about it. You know, set yourself apart from that and just think how things could be, right? Like in the future, like see yourself financially free, and then speak over your universe and just say, you know, no financial burden. No, I feel wonderful. I feel happiness. I feel great. I'm spreading that out, taking out that fear. Fear is gone. Don't have time for fear. Don't have space for fear. I am blessed. I am worthy of abundance. I'm worthy of healing. I'm worthy of great things. I'm worthy of happiness. So these guys over here laughing and stuff, carrying on, having a great time at the beach. That's for me too. And in my universe, so happiness and joy, prosperity. Right? Now, just as any other meditation you can imagine, I've started doing this and it's just as hard as anything else to keep your mind on track because we have monkey minds, right? We, our minds start going like everywhere. And uh, like the guys that are like walking by out here on the beach. I'm not sure if you see him, I can't see him. Oh, there they are. <laughs> it's a distraction, right? So what you have to do is just bring yourself back, get centered, close your eyes. It helps me if I close my eyes. And just think, okay, oh yeah, the blanket, my universe, right? Calmness. I feel strength. I think of a time when I was on top of the world and the way it felt, the way I felt invincible. My thoughts then, the smells, the colors, the everything, you can bring it. The mind will work with it. Your thoughts will work with it, right? So as you keep doing this, it becomes great. And you, I, I've actually seen things change because the way my mindset changes when I do this makes me feel more centered and that I'm in control of my universe, right? Through thought. I don't have to think those crazy things. Now, you do have to take responsibility for your actions, for what you do in life, yes. But you don't have to become a slave to all that. Yeah, we're on a journey here. Don't forget that. So anyway, take that. I'm going to work on these muscles too. I got a flip now, and we'll see you in a little bit. Take care.